The news of Mizbun Siddiq appointed as head coach of the Malaysian men's singles squad hit the headlines internationally. This would be the second time the former men's singles ace has taken up a coaching role with Badminton Association of Malaysia. From the early 2000s till his departure in 2011, Mizbun was instrumental in Lee Chong Wei's rise in world badminton, and his return to the national setup was not without some persuasion from his former student. Lee, who is in the final stretch of his illustrious career, yearned to work with his former mentor one more time, and Mizbun's vast experience would also bring a much needed boost to the development of Malaysia's men's singles. I was uh, asked by Lee Chong Wei, is somebody uh, some, something like my son? And he also take me as his father. And he tried to, to, to ask me to come back, I think more than eight to ten, ten times. So uh, it was a bit emotional at that time, whereby he knew that I will not take it. But after that, when I talked to my wife, my wife was there because I used to send my wife to, to the hospital. Uh, for his checkup and so on, but this time when I asked her, never mind, you can go. You help him out. So that's why I made that decision that to come back. Misbun's two-year appointment comes as part of BAM's new strategic planning in building a strong program for the next Thomas Cup in 2018. Having relied solely on Lee Chong Wei in singles at the men's team event had cost Malaysia dearly. So the administrators hope the wealth of experience of the well-known coach can bring out the best in the men's solo department. Uh, my job is to improve the player, uh, to make them prepare for tournaments. Uh, the most important that, uh, that I want is that there is no disturbance on what, what I want to create, uh, to create for these players. Because those players have their, their different differences in a lot of a lot of uh, means like uh, the body, uh, the body language, and then the the height, the the, the strong strong leg, and so on. So many many kind. So that is why I have to uh, uh, take charge on that to build them into a certain level. The most important is the support service that I need. The taskmaster, known for his no nonsense approach, heralded changes to the team's training program since his arrival in July. And his daily schedule that started at the crack of dawn took some getting used to. Yeah, memang agak tough because, uh, His training is of course very tough. From 5.30 to 11 in the morning. By 6am, we've picked up our intensity and already started on a multi-shuttle drill. So it was a bit different and it's very demanding. A bit tough. They get stunned, they get surprises. Why? Why? How come the training like that? How come? So this is this is something that they need should they, they should learn. Some some somebody should show them a good example. So when they at least see, wow, if if the coach come, let's say at five o'clock, so they have the coach have to wake up four a.m. Then morning. So if the coach can wake up four a.m., then of course I can wake up. A man of action, Misbun quickly identified certain areas that the team needed to address and his new training regimen is designed to meet the needs of both the senior and the younger players. He's definitely uh, putting a different perspective to, to things in, in the training. Uh, he's working them very, very hard and uh, discipline is, is the key. And I'm sure that uh, that's helping the, the young players as well. Whether one month can do it or not is, is a question mark. But I think in, in the long run, there's no doubt that the training will benefit the players. The new singles head coach also aims to create a positive atmosphere of camaraderie between coaches and players. And he believes the close bonds fostered will benefit the team. Uh, they must always uh, know that, uh, that I am trying to help them to be like a family. Those days when I trained even Chong Wei, if you think that I really train you so much and then I want you to help these players, uh, to, to a place and you don't want, you better go to that court, last court and take the shuttle and train yourself. When, when I make them as a family, you see how they gather together, they run together, they, they stand together just now, the last. So this is what whereby if you can respect it, each other in, in terms of uh, to build a, a champion, then it's easy. You can, you can, all the players can help each other to, uh, to, to bring the success. Miss Boon, uh, they're open-minded. Miss Boon is very open-minded. He accepts and understands whatever we discuss. We talk a lot about the game, the technical aspects, his experience in coaching Lee Chong Wei, 
and how his training was structured before. He will explain what is in our program, what we're good at and what we're bad at. Everything has been explained to us. Witnessing the working relationship between their number one shuttler in men's singles and his mentor will also no doubt inspire the rest of the team to work harder and aim higher. That's the, that's the point, whereby you have the model. You have the model, you have the icon. So when they play with Chong Wei, uh, they uh, realize uh, this uh, uh, tactical part where Chong Wei can stand is, is because there is no shortcut. So they, they, when they see this, they already know and they're already, they're already coming up with more desirable in training uh, to become like, like Chong Wei. The 57-year-old had been busy preparing the men's singles team for the Southeast Asia Games in Kuala Lumpur, Malaysia and the Total BWF World Championships. He had also been working closely with Lee, shaping him up for the ultimate individual prize in world badminton. I told him already, you, need, you don't need to fight, you need to challenge only because you are challenging your age, you are, not, you are challenging yourself. So that means your intelligence works. So now, when you already age, this one has to work. So you must be working very smart. With Ms. Bun Siddiq at the helm, fans will hope that Malaysia's men's singles will grow and develop at the highest level, bringing pride and glory to the country.